Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading this week to help you see the best ways to work with your own energy for the week. Our first card is Four of Water, and that's about being serene. Our second card is the Achiever of Water, which is Idealism. The third card is One of Earth, Groundedness, Foundation. And our final card is Keeper of Bridges, Persist. So we have a lot of emotional energy at the beginning of the week. And then we move into a grounded, solid place. And from there we can move forward in a direction that's steady and stable and durable. Begin your week by calming yourself. This is a great time to do some meditation or do some sort of activity that really settles your energy and helps you come home to yourself. Engage your ideals toward the beginning of the week. What is your vision? Whether it's for you or for your family or for the world around you, let yourself really tap into, in your perfect world, what would life look like? and begin setting some foundations for that idealistic vision to be something that you can live. Whether or not you can live it right now doesn't matter. Just make some steps in solidifying that ideal vision so that you have the, the potential of living it at some point. And then release anything that stands between you and your ideal. What is it in you that makes that ideal look impossible? What is it in your life that would hold you back from that? This doesn't mean that you have to quit a job or move or leave a relationship. This means release the attitudes, the perceptions, the emotional dynamics that keep you from being who you truly are capable of being in the world. And then move again. You laid a foundation here, stand on that foundation, find your direction, hold your ideal vision, and know that whether it's something that can be achieved in the space of a week or something that may take many, many years, you have the stamina to stay with it. Persist in that direction. So in summary for this week, your emotions come into play a lot. And so does a little bit of physical action, but more than that, solidifying things. Your spirituality comes in a bit at the end of the week, but it doesn't have a lot to do with what's going on at the beginning. At the beginning of the week, be at peace with yourself. Give yourself the serenity that allows your mind to know that all is well. And then connect with your ideal vision of whatever it is that you'd like to accomplish. Set some foundations. Let go of the things that separate you from your ideals. And persist. Just keep going forward. Ignore naysayers within you or outside of you. And just persist. Have a great, well-grounded, heartful week with us this week.